Hey guys, it's Illinik here, back with another awesome unboxing. And today I went to Toys R Us, hoping for Thunder Libra, but I couldn't find it. And as some of you know, not all of you, know that Green Lantern the movie is coming out this June, with Ryan Reynolds starring as Hal Jordan. And at the Toy Fair in February, we saw some of the Green Lantern toys that are being released. And I found some. Oh, yeah. As you see here, we have four. That's actually a five-inch figure, but it's only supposed to be four. Five-inch figure, Kilowog. It is Green Lantern number three. See, it says GL, which stands for Green Lantern. Comes with a power ring, the non-light-up version. And it comes with a adapter, a energy adapter. I'll tell you more about that later. And of course, of course, that was weird. Of course, Kilowog, which is actually about an inch thicker and taller than every every other Green Lantern in this line. See, it? energy blast adapter connects to most constructs. There he is, right there. And we see his bio and his home world, Bubble Box Vic Sector 674. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to angle the camera down and unbox this thing. Give you a good focus. Let's open it. No. It is opened, and here it is. So first we have the power ring that just pops out. By the way, what's kind of sad is that the, this power ring is very, very small. It is probably a size five, a, fi a size five ring, and I wear a size seven and a half. So it won't fit in my middle finger. And it'll barely, it's very snug, but it will at least come off on my index. Probably doesn't even, oh, yep, doesn't even fit my pinky. Yeah. So I'd be careful when you're putting on this ring. Here we have the energy blast adapter what this is is that with the energy blasts that come with the other three or four figures in this line you can just attach it on where the Grand green lantern's fist would go and just make it look even cooler and i guess it kind of make it bend i guess maybe you could just even use this as like a a beating device you go like bow bow and here we have the big old thing, Kilowog, that can stand up on its own. Freaky. It's pretty cool. Now, the articulation on this is it can move its head 360, which is it's very tight, though. It has no elbow or knee movement, but it has hip movement. cannot go back, but it can go up. So you can kind of make this weird sitting position. And his waist can go 360. He has no wrist movement. And his elbows can go up like this. And 360. So kind of weird articulation there. It's not that, it's not bad, but you know, it's okay. And the energy blast is pretty snug in his fist, but can easily be popped out. So that's pretty much it. So this is Kilowog. It's a pretty nice figure. I actually have Hal Jordan to compare. See, look at that. That's like one or two inches. One or two inches right there. And 
I have Hal Jordan's Energy Blast Fist, and we'll see how it works. Just pops in there. And there you go. You can kind of make it even longer than normal. And kind of make it look cooler, I guess. I have no idea what the reason for an adapter is, besides making it look more intimidating. 3D. Woo. So that is pretty much it for Kilowog. This adapter can fit all of the four inch energy blast pieces and you can make it look like a cool little tip to your finger so that's pretty much it i hope you enjoyed this unboxing of kilowog a review may be coming soon i'm not really promising it i might not do one just post in your con in the comments below if you want me to do a review so a quick recap we get the adapter kilowog you don't get how jordan sadly and then you get the non-light-up power ring, which is very small. Sadly small. Will even fit as a whole arm? Now that looks cool. So, this has been Illinuk. Have fun, and bay away.